Hey you guys, so today I will be doing my June favorites and I literally can't believe the month is over and we're literally like halfway through the whole year. It's like we're like right in between and I can't believe the year is like half gone. Like where did it go? It, like I work retail and it feels like not too long ago we were putting up all the um, Christmas stuff, the Thanksgiving stuff, the New Year stuff and now it's like the end of June. I can't believe like literally like it, it just went like it felt like maybe like a month went by but now it's the end of June so I have some favorites that I want to share with you guys and I don't have a lot but I've been trying a lot of new products this month and I just wanted to share with you guys because I think I found some really good products so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and get started so first off I'm gonna start off with a mascara and it's the Bad Gal Lash and I got this at Sephora and I paid like ten dollars for it so it's like their mini travel size one that you can find on those uh, containers when you're about to check out. And I really like it because look at the bristles on this thing. It's ginormous. I really, really like it. And um, I've been using this all through the month of June. Yep, so I highly recommend this one. Next is a tinted moisturizer. And since it's starting to get really hot out, I haven't been using like foundation or any other stuff. I've just been going for tinted moisturizer. Well, first off, I don't use makeup all day but when I do use it I've been using this tinted moisturizer it's by Laura Mercier if I'm pronouncing that right and um, it has SPF of 20 so that's good especially since it's summer now I think it's summer I don't know I think it is it might be still be spring I don't know I don't know when's the official day of summer but it feels like summer to me so that's the word I'm gonna use all right next I've also been into uh, bright bold lips and I've been using a lip gloss from Victoria's Secret and it's in the shade electric I don't know if you guys can see it but um I really like it it's this um kind of like a burgundy kind of like a raspberry red I'm gonna swatch some for you guys all right so that's what it looks like I'm actually I was wearing it earlier but then I went out for breakfast and took it off but um I, I'm really into uh, deep bright bold colors like this right now and then for uh, next um, it's a blush and this is probably the most exciting thing that I'm this is probably the, the item that I'm more excited for I'm so excited I can't even talk because I finally got my first I guess you could say makeup item from Mac so I got a blush and it's one of their uh, cream blend brush and it got it in the sh in the shade something special and this is what it looks like and as you can tell, I've been using it a lot. Well, I don't know if you guys can tell. But I've been using it a lot. And it's just this very nice coral peachy color. And I'll swap, swatch some for you guys. I don't know if you guys could tell, but I don't, I don't think you guys can. But it's, it's right here. I don't think you guys can see it on camera. But I really like it. Um, so it was my first thing that I purchased from MAC. And I know I will be going back for some more of these uh, creamy blushes. I really like them. Alright, next I have a lip balm. My lips have been, they've been chapped for the past like week. And um, once again, I think it's because it's summer and it's starting to get so hot out. And I don't know, I just need some moisture back into my lips. So I purchased this, I think it's called Burt's Bees. I don't know if you guys can see it. And this is the refreshing one. It's in grapefruit. And I really like it. I really, I really like the way it leaves my lips. They're so soft, so smooth. So I highly recommend that. And it's very inexpensive. I pay like $2.50 for it at Walmart. So I really like that. Next, it's a hair accessory. And it's these right here. It's like a headband. It's um from Goody. Pretty much you just... I've been wearing it a lot on my videos. But I'm going to show you guys. So I've been using this with my hair curly and my hair straight. Oh, it's all over the place. Okay. So pretty much that's how it looks like. And I feel like it's one of those items that you could really dress up your, like, I guess dress up your hair or something. But I really like it. And it's the reason that I like it the most is because this is the first, like, headband that doesn't keep coming up my head, like, my head like during the whole day I don't know if any of you guys have the same problem but this is the first headband that like it actually stays like where I put it that's exactly where it stays so that's why I'm liking that and I and it comes in like a, a silver um 
this thing comes like in a silver tone and also comes in this gold one but my favorite one is the gold one but i like them both so and that's them they're very expensive i pay like 320 for them at walmart also all right next once again because i think it's starting to get really hot out my hair has been feeling like a broomstick like no lie it feels like like a broomstick i can't even it's just so hard and so dry and i just needed moisture back into my hair as well so i i've been using this product and it's the bio silk and um the bio silk therapy and i started using this product i think last summer and then i don't know why i stopped i think i just started using new products and i just stopped but recently i was digging for it and i found it so i started using it again and now i remember why i liked it so much like my hair is starting to get back to normal it's not as it's not it's hard it's not so i can't even explain it but it literally felt like a broomstick now it's going back to its normal texture next it's a body spray and i haven't been using perfume a lot because i think since it is so hot out, it's starting to get kind of sticky, and I don't know, I just haven't been using perfume as much. So I've been um, going for a body mist, and I'm using the one from Pink with a Splash Pretty and Pure. And I actually got this, like, around Christmas time, and I didn't get a chance to use it. I put it somewhere in my closet or in my drawer. Yeah, so I just kind of threw it into, like, I think one of my drawers, and then I never took it back out. But I've been using this a lot, a lot in the month of June, as you can tell, I'm, like, almost halfway there. So I'm really liking this. I'll probably go back and buy the bigger bottle of that. Next, I've been using a spray gel. I haven't been using hairspray a lot because, like I said, my hair was starting to feel like a broomstick. So I felt if I were to put more hairspray on it, it would just damage it more. So I've been going for something that I think it's lighter. So it's a spray gel, and I've been using one from Pantene. It's the Curl Enhancer. It's the pink one. And I really like this because... It, like it holds my hair but then it also uh leaves it like where i could touch it and it's not so hard so i really like that and i don't think it dries my hair out as much as it does with like regular hairspray so i'm loving that and then i have three random products that i just wanted to include in here because i've been i guess you can say eating them all through the month of june and yeah so first off i've been eating frosted flakes a lot and this is actually like like a big family box. I got it also at Walmart and I pay like $3 for it. So I'm really liking this because I have not eaten cereal like no lie since I got out of high school and it's probably been like two years now. So I've just been eating, um, I think I haven't even been eating breakfast. It's probably just like coffee. I don't know, but I haven't been eating, um, as much, I guess. And if I do eat, it's probably just junk food. So I'm trying to get out of the habit of that. I know this is not as healthy, but I figured that I'd rather have something for breakfast since breakfast is the most important part of the meal. I mean, not the meal of the day. And so, um, yeah, so I've been like liking these. And they also remind me so much of high school. Like, just like literally pouring this into the bowl and just sitting down and eating this reminds me so much. Like, it brings back so many memories. Like, I don't know so I'm really liking this and I'm almost done as well with them well I had a little help from my brother but most of it was all me so I love that and next like I said since it's been getting really hot in here um if I am outside or we're just having out a barbecue or something with the family I've been eating a lot of these free freezy pops I think that's what they're called and my favorite one is actually the purple one for this month so if you guys eat Freezy Pops and you guys like them, let me know what is your favorite flavor or color. Right now, I'm really liking the purple one, but, um, but yeah, and I think if you buy, like, different brands, they also taste a bit different ones, because I bought one in a blue box, and, I mean, these taste good, but it just seems like I've been having such a hassle with them. Like, every time I try to, like, tear them off the, the little slip it comes in, like, they've been, like, ripping and I don't know. But then I also purchased a yellow box. I don't know if it was from the same brand. I don't think so. And those had more flavor and they were so much easier to um, tear off the slip when I was trying to eat them. So I do recommend the yellow box if there is a if there is a difference. And then last but definitely not least is this blanket because we do have the AC on all day. And it gets pretty chilly in here. But I got this at Victoria's Secret. I actually ordered online. I don't know if they have it at the store, but I, I ordered mine online. It was like $35, but it's this huge. I don't even think I can fit it in the screen, but let me try to get up for you guys. So, it's this huge, like, leopard um, 
stadium blanket I think that's what it's called so it has like the leopard print and then oh god I have it backwards and then they also have the um it has like in pink let's party I don't think you guys can see it but it says let's party love pink so I'm really loving this but I could, like, it's so big I could literally like wrap myself in it all day if I wanted to well if I wanted to because I don't think that's gonna happen because I gotta go to work but May have my day off or something. I just want to like chill in my bed and just rest. And this is awesome. It's so soft and so cuddly. So I really like it. All right. So that is it for my June favorites. Hopefully it was not too long. Hopefully I didn't bore you guys. So if you guys have any favorites for the month of June or just current favorites, make sure to leave it as a video response down below. And I will talk to you guys later.